This video is going to have a bit of a different format, so before we start, I just wanted to quickly explain how the sentencing will work. I will be tracking two sentences. One will be the regular sentence, which is the crimes he commits no matter what, no matter how you play the game, no matter how you beat the boss battle. And below it will be the extras, which are crimes he commits depending on how you play the game. For example, you beat the Bowser boss fight without taking any damage. Bowser will get an aggravated assault charge, doesn't matter how you play it, that's what he gets. However, it is possible he murders you in the boss fight, which lands him an extra murder charge. I hope that's clear, let's begin. In the first Mario game, Bowser kidnaps the princess along with seven toads. He also fights with Mario eight times, and three of those times he throws hammers at Mario. He will receive eight counts of kidnapping, five counts of aggravated assault, and three counts of aggravated assault with a deadly weapon. He will also receive an extra first degree murder charge in the event he kills Mario. Bowser actually isn't in this game, so moving on. Relatively standard Bowser action here. He kidnaps the princess, he tries to kill Mario, and as an extra, he can kill Mario. Bowser commits what I now call the Bowser Trio of charges, being aggravated assault, kidnapping, and the extra of first degree murder. We can also throw on arson for when he shoots fire at Mario, and I don't even want to imagine what Bowser is doing to the princess here. <laughs> Even though Bowser does commit crimes in this game, he's also a baby in this game, and legally babies cannot be charged for crimes because they don't know right from wrong. It usually goes down to the parent's responsibility. In this game, Bowser doesn't just kidnap the princess, but steals her castle too. So in addition to the Bowser trio, we can add burglary for stealing the castle, two extra aggravated assault charges since you fight Bowser three times, and we can also add grand larceny since he steals the power of the stars, whatever that means. Mario, how dare you disturb my family vacation? <laughs> Bowser in the pool commits arson since he's breathing fire outside his own property. He's shooting rockets at Mario, which is the Mario equivalent of shooting a gun, so we'll give him a dangerous use of firearms charge for that. He also kidnaps Peach, again, and as an extra, he can kill Mario, so that's first degree murder on the extra. Hmm? Yeah, you know where this is going.
Bowser goes a bit overboard here as he declares war on the Mushroom Kingdom and commits war crimes by bombing the civilians and even crystallizing them. He also gets three counts of kidnapping for the princess and the two toads that were with her. You fight Bowser three times and throughout the fight he's trying to kill you so he can give him first degree attempted murder and then sometimes he can succeed and therefore for the extra that's first degree murder. Bowser outlines his extensive plans to rule the universe, with his first action being the creation of a new galaxy. Now that in itself isn't a bad thing, assuming it doesn't affect any of the galaxies when it's created, but the ruling the universe part definitely would land him some war crimes, since he's already taken steps towards this goal. Bowser pretty much commits the same crimes he did in the first game, except he's huge. This is the first time Bowser explicitly shows intent to kill Mario, rather than just beat him up. This will land him a first degree attempted murder charge.
this is the only time Bowser does anything in the entire game, as the rest of these, he is infected with a black goo, Spider-Man 3 style. Even though this is a bit aggressive, Mario, he doesn't seem to mind. So, no charges, moving on. This is actually the first time we see Bowser punch Mario, as well as the classic arson and aggravated assault to go along with it. Call me crazy, but I don't think Peach wanted to marry Bowser. This feels forced. I don't know, it might just be me. 